Hey guys, this is Gorax. Today I'd like to show you a new event that's gonna happen on Wednesday. During that event, you spend coins to unlock mines. After unlocking the mines, other buildings in an order screen will appear. During the event, manage the mines and complete orders to earn red crystals that can be exchanged for rewards at the crystal trading post. Complete the missions coordinator missions to earn wish lanterns that can speed up order completion. After a mine is built, it will produce ores at a constant rate until it reaches the storage limit. Once the limit is reached, it will stop producing ores. Ore production will resume only when storage space is available again. During the event, players will get a harvest prayer once a day. Pr prayer can't refresh at 5 o'clock and a new sprays will be saved. When the available storage space is smaller than the ore quantity the pra that a prayer gives, Players will not be able to pray. After the event unused, red crystals and wish lanterns will be recalled via email. Right, the event even has quite good rewards. As you can see here, you can get the Kronokia component chest, which is quite worth it, as well as a premium artifact, command unit tokens, and other goods such as star souls. You can get one star soul in, that was gonna cost you a, a thousand red crystals, some void mithril emblems, and pretty good rewards. Altogether, I'm not sure how much crystals you can get through the event. As you can see, you can buy some in the shop. You can buy 10, by our, well, you can buy a 150 10 times for 350 diamonds, and you can buy one daily. There are also packs uh, that can give you this, uh, but obviously, they cost money. You got quests that give you the lanterns, which speed up the uh, production of the ores, and these quests will change daily. And uh, well, I can't really tell that because obviously on the test server it wasn't that easy to test and you can use the lanterns here to speed it up during the test I had zero lanterns um, so I couldn't really test it uh, but let's just refresh it let's see what it does okay so I'm refreshing and we'll be able to see that there's a different uh, reward for getting these ores there are three different ores right uh, it's a silver ore, iron ore, and a gold ore available. You could harvest prayer that increases the quantity of the ores of all the ores, iron, silver, and gold. And as you can see, I've done it. I prayed, I got 120 each. I still need a little bit more to get the reward, so I'm gonna do that again. I'll just do it all. I'll just use all the counts, as you can see, four days. Okay, and I'm gonna get these crystals. Obviously, as you can see, the amount of crystals I got is really low. That's because I didn't play that event. It just happened once. Okay, and because the dates on test server just jump around. And as you can see, I'm getting these rewards. Obviously, you want definitely to refresh that as much as possible to get the highest reward possible. I think that's how it works. Obviously, this is just a preview, guys. This is just that to show you what to do. On top of that event, there will also be these lamps spawning and they can give you quite nice rewards like uh, diamonds, uh, gold keys, astro, silver and uh, scrolls. Basically what we used to have many times, just gonna spawn again. And here is a new uh, altar that's gonna pop up on Wednesday it, on the test server and it includes four units. Here you can see them. And just remember guys, uh, everything that you see today might be changed because the footage is taken from the test server and everything is due to change. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.